Head and it's time to welcome another star guest to this morning show. We have Anthony Head from Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Now then, we've got loads of emails for you, but before we, we dive in, what we're going to do first of all is show a little clip <gasps> of you in action. Here it is. They're coming here now? Well, what, why do they have to come here? Yeah, don't they have phones? Hello, Buffy. Here's some stuff we know. Pip, pip. Yeah. Phones. See, I'd like them on phones. Well, what's so bad about them coming here? Aren't they good guys? I mean, Watchers, that's just like other Gileses, right? Yeah, they're scary and horrible. Um, they, well, they can appear a bit, well, uh, hard-nosed, but, but well, essentially their agenda is the same as ours. They want to save the world and... May I say in that clip you look like <laughs> handsome and intellectual? Action packed! <laughs> <laughs> it was a lot of stumbling, wasn't it? Mumbling, lots of mumbling. But it's very good, though. Thank you. Very, very Can good. I, before we go on, I have to say uh -huh. good morning to Emily and Daisy and to Natalie, their friend who's a huge fan, and also to Phoebe West, who stayed the night last night. Hello, girls. Hello. Morning. Good morning. Good morning. Hey, you want to share your pro? <laughs> <laughs> right, that's all we've got time for. Now. <laughs> <laughs> right, I've got, I've got an email here from Tom from Harpenden, and he says, what is your favourite Buffy moment? Um, 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 I get, well, it's, it's a very sad moment, but um, there's a moment when, when Jelly Calendar was killed um that uh i had to t tell the girls um allison and um sorry buffy and, and willow on the telephone and they put a, a live telephone in the studio and i was talking to them so the reaction oh really yeah so the reaction that you see is is the real reaction right. it was it was a very sad moment oh. <laughs> Just, yeah. I'm, I'm sorry, you brought Possibly something the technical of your acting Thanks for all the <laughs> sorry. i've got one here from uh, marina from cardiff she says is it true there's going to be a musical episode of buffy it is, and it's... Really? It's, Are you singing? Yeah, it's cracking. It's really? Do you sing the whole story is it from start to finish? You no, it's, it's talking and, and singing, but it's just Joss Whedon, the creator. Um, basically, he wrote it, he started summer break, and he didn't stop. And basically, he's written all the music, all the words, and it's fantastic. It runs at an, an hour, eight minutes. It's over the usual hour. Right. And it's just fantastic. We watched it last week. Um, they sent a copy over, and it's just... It's blinding. Right. Oh, so you've really? done it already? Yeah. When will we see that over here? I don't know. It's episode <laughs> seven of season six, so... Um, Next year sometime then. Yeah. Mm. yeah. Were, they, were you and the rest of the cast nervous about singing? Or? Well, not me, because I've, I've, I've done a few musicals. Well, he's done a few no, musicals in this time, you know, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> um, no, once you've done, once you've done Frankenfurter in Rocky Horror, you can oh, do it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I can see it now. <laughs> <laughs> Sarah Casey in Harrogate wants to know, will you be starring in any other shows apart from Buffy in the future? As it happens, uh, I've just done a, a show for BBC Two called Manchild, which is coming out in uh, January. It's a, it's a little adult, um, so it'll be kind of showing after the watershed, I think, right. it'll be sort, of, sort of after nine-ish. But it's very, very funny. It's with Nigel Havers, uh, Ray Burdis and Don Warrington, and we're, and we're four right. guys in our 40s, kind of, uh, well, men being children, basically. Right. right. Bachelors again. Kind of, yeah, mm. yeah, yeah. She's so right. got the original oh, charmer in there. I'm sure that'll <laughs> yeah, get us all really, kinds of really funny stuff. This one here is from Alice Chamberlain in Wolverhampton, and mm. she says, "Have you ever been mobbed by female Buffy fans?" Um, not that I can recall, but I did, there was, there was, when I did Frankenfurter, it was the bit you know the, the the fans used to hang out outside the stage door in all the gear. So, and, yeah. and I always used to think, how long have they been standing there? Yeah. And, like, no <laughs> clothes at all. But um, it was sort of mobbing, I suppose, really, kind of, ish, <laughs> maybe. I don't know if we believe you. Uh, <laughs> if, you if you see him, they did, just give him a little mob. Did you just, just mob yeah. him a bit? <laughs> get a mob coming on, you know. <laughs> mob away. Well, thank you very much for joining us this morning, thank Anthony. You. And you're going to stay and play around in chums anyway. Oh, Anthony yes. Head, everybody. Thank you. Oh, yeah.